Hey everybody, uh, we, uh, we redesigned our deck, so uh, I was going to show you how to fix this uh, rail, it's a decorative rail, uh, with some uh, uh, decoration on the handrail, alright, on the rail, and on one of them, okay, it broke right here, so it's a clean break, all the pieces are there, that's the key thing. I'm going to show you how to fix this, what you're going to need is two thin pieces of wood to brace it, come up with spring clamps, it's going to cover everything, be big enough, some wood glue, and some kind of paper towels or something to clean up the wood glue. Uh, it's going to take about a day to cure and make it to where it's not going to break again, and then we're going to put it back in. Okay, this is like a preliminary fitting. There's a hole right there that this guy went into. All right, so I'm going to put that in. I'm going to kind of jiggle it a little bit, not breaking anything. Push it together as best as I can, and that's about the closest it'll get. Okay, we can always sand it down a little bit to, to smooth it out and then repaint it white. But that's our that's our fitting. So we're gonna back it off a little bit, and we're gonna coat a put a coat of paint in there, not paint. I'm sorry, glue, and then uh, clamp it together and uh, see how it turns out. Now you want to get as full coverage of the glue as you can on the surface. Rotate it around so it doesn't drip. You have your paper towel ready, okay? And now I can't really tell where the hole is, but I'm gonna guess it's right. Uh, we gotta we gotta search for it. Okay, and there it is. So go ahead and uh, be over the paper towel because see it's coming out right there. Have that on top so the gravity will pull it back down. Okay, and that's seated in. So what we need to do now is uh, I'm going to put this over here and we're going to put a clamp around it. Okay, so uh, bear with me because I know the camera's over to the left, but I need to get a clamp on this thing. Uh, I don't have the camera on the tripod, so uh, that. Let me get the strap off there. So that's going to be it. Right now it's kind of crooked. You can see it's crooked right now. Once I get a clamp on there, on both ends it will be straight. I don't have three hands so I can't really do this, but put a clamp on one end and right there take your other hand while holding that side. Okay, take your hand on this end and push in and then put the clamp in. Alright, three people, I mean two people should be doing this because it's hard to hold. I just want to nail it down, okay? But you need to get pressure on that, so that's as tight as it can be, and then put your clamp on there to hold it. And there you go. It's straight, it's straight uh, this way because it's on a straight level, a uh, level uh, surface. It's straight going this way across because I have these on the side here. So it's as straight as it can be, and also as tight as it can be. I had somebody come out and help me, and you can see the glue. All right, so that glue can be actually, when it's dry, it can be sanded down. It's wood glue. All right, and it's got full coverage in there, so it should bond very nicely. We'll see in about a day. Okay, so uh, I can actually pick this up now and put it on something because it is straight as it could be, and the clamps are in place. Now, I waited 24 hours, and the seal is really nice. Uh, the, you can't really get your fingernail in there at all. And what I did is I used a Dremel tool with a round tip, a sanding tip in here. Okay, and uh, went around in this position going around. Okay, so fit in there nicely. I didn't press down too hard. And where it does hit the white, no big deal, because when you paint this, you know, the paint's going to fill in. And you know what? I'm tapping this right now, and it's not going to come apart. Now, something I didn't show you when I pulled this off. Okay, we have two holes in the end. And I'm going to walk out, walk you out here. Oop, there goes the Dremel tool. I have three of them. I'm not, no big deal. I don't really hope I didn't do it, but you can see that one's in the middle and one's on top. The problem with this is this top rail here, there's two pieces here and these come apart. Okay, so uh, what you need to do is come in here and find a small, the, the, the center one kind of and the one off to the side and kind of push this up inside, okay, like that. Kind of get them in there and push them up. This should be the same direction once they get all the way up. And I'm just pushing it up. It should match. Should match. I might need two hands to do this. Okay, I see the ant killer didn't get these guys. <laughs> My ant bait. And once that's up all the way in there, the bottom's going to slide in and you'll have to put a screw on the bottom down there next to that leaf. Okay, just work your way up and when I'm done, I'll show you it when it's all finished. Okay, it's a done deal. And there it is, a done deal. Okay, uh, put, a, put a new uh, nail in the bottom. It doesn't look like any of those because it's not corroded. All right, it's in there as straight as all the rest. And that's the, see where those screws are? That's what comes out of the bottom that the, the two nails are on and it sits up in that rail. 
Okay, so, uh, yep, that's the one right there. Okay, uh, so, so once it's painted, you're not even going to see that. I challenge you to even look for it, and because I know it's there, I might notice it, but no big deal. So, uh, hey, I hope you liked the video. Uh, see a whole lot more, including, including the hammer that I used to put this in. I'm testing because uh, the whole head of the hammer came off of the handle, and there's a new bond out that um, I'm testing. So, uh, going through a lot of testing, and you can see that on my channel real soon. Bye now.